Stroman cars. I clung to this world for too long before I cast it aside as a failed experiment. You didn't cast it aside. I fought you and drove your spirit into hiding. I had already shifted my focus to Sakul many centuries before your victory here. This is the empty husk I left behind. But the Sith could still be a useful tool to help you seize the Eternal Throne. Honored guests, welcome to Dromund Kass. Moff Lorman. It's Minister Lorman now. Really? I figured your career was over after you lost the Ascendant Spear. This story sounds too good to pass up. Back in my SIS days, I may have blown up a prototype Sith warship. Lorman was the deputy commander. It's Minister Lorman, and the past is irrelevant. I serve Empress Asina now. She awaits us in the throne room. Welcome, Commander. These are strange times. Did you ever imagine the Sith would negotiate with a Jedi? I see we're beginning with a round of compliments. There is no point hiding our past. But the future depends on the correction of our flaws. I urge you not to be so critical, Empress. The Sith Empire has always been glorious. I would like to continue this conversation on my personal shuttle. Just the two of us, speaking freely. It may not be wise to split up. I can handle myself if she tries anything. Will you two be okay if I leave you with Lorman? It's Minister Lorman! Minister Lorman! Is that so hard to remember? Don't worry about us, Commander. There remain Sith who do not approve of the Alliance I offer. They hold tight to the old ways. But to stop Valen, we must work together. Taking her down is all that matters. I welcome any help I can get. This does not end with Valen. We both know there is only one path to victory. You want to seize the Eternal Throne, and I will help you. I want nothing to do with the throne. You hardly have a choice. Unchecked, Valin will grind us into dust. I am not powerful enough to stop her. You are, with my help. Engine's non-responsive. We need to bring it down. We're coming in too fast. Bail out! Your skills are impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. You handle yourself well in a fight. I can pilot a shuttle, too, unless someone sabotages it. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. Lorman's behind this. I know it. Lorman lacks both the courage and competence to orchestrate a direct attempt on my life. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. Just about into the main network. Someone's coming.
forgive the intrusion, but I come bearing tragic news. The Empress's shuttle has crashed. Crashed where? Somewhere in the jungle. Unfortunately, the emergency locator is not transmitting. That's... Uh, that's impossible. Not if the shuttle disintegrated. I'm afraid there's only one logical conclusion. The Empress and Commander are dead. Slogging through the forest to hunt you down was going to be the worst part of this job. It's so much easier when the targets come to us. This doesn't need to end with violence. Violence is the Geno Harridan style. The Geno Harridan? I thought you were just a myth. That's because we never leave witnesses. Beacon destroyed, comm signals still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. Even the weather is trying to kill us. We could take refuge in the Geno Haridan camp if we can find it. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. Look at this as an adventure. That is not reassuring. Looks like the storm's not letting up anytime soon. I say we grab a shuttle and head out now. The interference will disable comms and scanners, not to mention the risk of an electrical surge frying our circuits. Sean, I just heard the news. Let me express my sincere condolences. SIS reporting has gone downhill since I left. The commander is missing, not dead. Don't let foolish hope blind you. You are leaderless, as are the Sith. Someone must step in to fill the void. Forgive me, but aren't you the former Republic Chancellor? You've already served your term. True leaders don't need titles to hold power. I want what your leader wanted, to defeat Valen. Join me, and we can finish what he started. Pass. I've had more than my fill of working with you. You're still grieving. Eventually, you'll realize I'm right. Storm be damned. The time for patience is past. Let's find the commander. I suppose the shuttle was too much to hope for. I found something. It's not enough to simply crash the shuttle. I want to see the bodies. No bodies, no bonus. Chancellor Suresh. That Republic snake. Suresh is no longer in charge of the Republic. True but intelligence believes she still holds significant power. Into the temple! I 
I'm sure there's another way out. You've got a pretty positive attitude about all this. Being Empress of the Sith and an optimist aren't mutually exclusive. Reports from Drome and Kaas claim the Outlander is dead. No. Father's spirit is still rattling around in there. His little pet is alive. The truth is irrelevant. The rumors have thrown the Alliance into disarray. Now is the perfect time to strike. Odessan is too heavily defended. That doesn't change just because their precious Outlander is missing. Odessan is not the target. Sith Lord. I once thought these ancient temples held the secrets to immortality. I was wrong. The search for immortality is a dangerous one. Only to those limited by their own flesh. I have transcended. Emperor of the Sith was my first face. But it is merely one of many I have worn. And what about the face you wear now? I found Valkorion centuries ago. He was a great warrior, a champion of ancient Zakul. It was only natural I hollow him out to use as my vessel. I saw potential in the primitive world, so I raised it to perfection. You speak of Zakul as though it's your favorite child. The Eternal Empire deserves more than my children ever did. When you take the throne, you will understand. We still need to go deeper if we hope to find another passage to the surface. A1. Now's not a good time. This can't wait. Suresh just sent a message. She's heading here to Odessan. Seems she didn't wait for us to change our minds after all. Send her pack in the second she lands. Some of the troops want to hear her out. They aren't sure the Alliance can last. There are rumors about the Commander. Remind them where their loyalties lie. Stall Suresh. We're on our way. Mr. Lawman warned us you might sneak off. Don't you know it's rude to make me come out in a storm like this? We should just seal the passage behind us, trapping you in here forever. Not an option. Suresh wants the corpses. No bodies, no bonus. You don't have to do Suresh's bidding, Lorman. You're better than that. It's Minister Lorman, and I don't answer to Suresh. We're partners. Don't do this. There's still time to make things right. The Alliance Commander is more merciful than I am. I would listen to him. It's not Lorman's call. The Geno Harridan always finished the job. No witnesses! I brought them right to you. Now finish them! For the Sith!
much blood. Stay back! I've taken your friends hostage! Anything happens to me and they're dead! This is Minister Lawman. Let me speak to the prisoners. Oh, hello, Lawman. This is who you sent to capture us? I'm a little offended. I'm glad you're both safe. You gave us quite a scare. It's good to hear your voice. I was ready to hunt you down myself. Charging through the jungle to rescue me. How romantic. Don't forget the part where I wring the Chancellor's neck. Suresh wants the Alliance, Commander. She's on Odessa as we speak. Hold tight. I'm on my way. You are my guest. Would you like to execute the traitor, or should I? It's time to embrace new methods, Empress. Be merciful, and you'll have a loyal servant for life. Unsatisfying, but I will try it your way. Members of the Alliance, as many of you have already heard, your commander is dead. There are dark times ahead, but fear not. I have come to offer you a beacon. I assume you know everything, then. I'll take that as a yes. It doesn't matter. The Alliance needs a leader like me. I saw an opportunity and I took it. I won't apologize for that. We are well beyond apologies. What do we do with her? Execution, I expect. It's what Valen would do. It's what I would do. That's the difference between us. You get to live, though you'll be in an Alliance prison for a long, long time. Take her away. You have no idea how happy I am. Empress Asina is waiting for your call, Commander. We'll meet you in the war room. I apologize for everything on Droman Cuss, but I still believe we should unite your people with mine. You've proven yourself, Asina. I accept your offer. That doesn't mean you're home free. We're watching you. Knowing Theron, not even your Hollow Net activity is safe. 
Remind me to change my access codes. I look forward to working with you. Ten up or the gravestone. We got your back, Radala. You okay? We've taken heavy damage. Need to make emergency repairs. Roger that, Radala. We'll bring your freighter on board. Just hold tight. Much appreciated, Koth. Looking forward to meeting you in person. <laughs> 